Good morning. We've got rain. You guys eat in there today, okay? Morris! Where are you? He can't be too far away. There's Tux. He's dry up here, but it's raining. It's raining good enough to be undercover while you eat. Keep you dry, chow dry. Wherever Morris is, he doesn't want to come get in this. Probably up the hill in that doghouse or under the shed up there. You were, um, you weren't up here. Hey, bud. I'm glad you come running, though. I think everything's fine. Hopefully you and Morris weren't in the same vicinity. What were you doing down in the woods? There's Morris. Good morning, Morris. Hi. Stripe's already gone back to sleep up top. All right, Ruby. Let's get this show on the road. Poor dirty girl. And hope that it um, won't rain hard on the way in. Thank you, Ruby. It's uh, about 6.45 right now, and uh, NWS has issued a strong, heavy rain, 30 mile per hour wind. That the, I guess the strongest part of the storm passing through at 7.45 a.m. So basically I'll be at St. Monica. So um, that's a good place to wait it out for a few minutes if it's gonna be impactful of driving safely. So there's no protection from hail over there, but um, it's a safe place to sit for a few minutes and evaluate if I wanna start to trek back to the house. Model 3 up here has a license plate, lot fun. It is a rainy mess out here this morning. Uh, just before we got to Garner, I saw a message pop up, I swear, for less than two seconds that said left side and then it was gone. Um, it was yellow and it was in the driver instrument cluster, obviously, for the X. Um, I have no idea what that message was. The control panel for the X has not been updated with the little triangle icon so you can go see past notifications. I uh, updated the Tesla app to try to find the tire pressure and I don't see it yet. I do see the radio controls. Yeah, it's raining. It's not fun this morning at all. Wow, lucky for Johnny, the rain let up right before he had to get out and we're on time at 7.30 so he's not, he's not late. The students that have to park that drive on they park over here to the right and then they have to walk from down that way all the way up that way. It's uh, a pretty long walk. I feel for him this morning. I told Johnny if we knew how to pick up a couple of his friends and save them that walk this morning, I would go get them, but there's just no good way to get back there for me. Phew. I'm at St. Monica's and I'm just gonna sit here and play Pokemon for a few minutes even though it's not raining much. I think um, that heavy rain that we just went through is what's fixing to go through Fuquay because my alert was for Fuquay at 7.35, but I'm gonna look at the radar and um, check in with Dawn and play Pogo for a minute before I head back south. Yeah, I could have done without that rain on the way in this morning. <laughs> Well, it looks to me, number one, that we won't be having any rain in about an hour. That's good for our friends that are in town that are touring NC State campus with their son today. They need to be walking between buildings and not dealing with umbrellas and stuff. So I think it's going to clear up for them. That's good. I think the heavy cell already went past the house in Fuquay, and it was more substantial or as substantial as what I went through. But um, that's kind of drifting north a little bit as it moves east. So I do think if I waited out about 15 minutes, which I'm normally stopped over here for about that long anyway, playing Pogo and filming videos and checking my messages and all that good stuff, then I think I won't run through any of it on the way home. And it's also getting a lot more daylight right now. Um, so that's good too. <sighs> and I'm going to go look up where the tire pressure is supposed to be in the app. I'm not getting any alerts. I don't know what that was. I suspect it was for a camera but i sure would like to have seen what it was tesla you have to leave messages up for somewhere at least three seconds and more like five seconds don't put it up there if you're not going to leave it up there that long long enough for me to read it or someplace where i can go back and look at the log because you know when i do the videos when i put text up 
um like if i expect you to be able to read a sentence while the video is scrolling it's five it's five seconds if it's two or three sentences it's six to eight seconds if it's you know like the whole screen is full then like maybe eight to ten but i would say most of the time in the video it's uh three to five seconds five seconds is probably good don fusses at me gives me constructive feedback if i don't leave the you know he kind of trained me early on and i since i listen to well let's say 95 percent of everything i shoot during edit um you know, I, I try to read it while it's scrolling past after I add it. And if I can't read it, then you can't read it, right? Um, so the only time I skimp on listening to everything is if there's like a 10-minute clip. And um, I really remember good what we said and was happy with it. I might only listen to the beginning and the end to get the transitions right. But I don't, I don't do that often just if I'm like super tired. <laughs> I really do and edit listen back to about everything I shot during the day. You know, over time I've learned to, um, I, I delete clips I know are no good so they're not in the middle of my good clips since I'm dropping them down by um, file name which is essentially date and time created, right? Um, and, um, you know, I, I, some days I do better than others but there's things I can do while I'm shooting during the day that make editing at night a lot easier and um, keep me out of trouble. <laughs> well, I can now pause the music from the app. So if I wanted to leave the phone open, I could pause that way without having to reach farther over on the screen to pause it until my scroll wheels are working again. I don't see the tire pressure in the app for anything. Uh, article I read said it would show up under the service tab. That seems odd. Um, but I'm not seeing it. But I, I have the latest app installed on my phone now and I know in Tesla Fi I saw Ruby was reporting the tire pressure so I know the behind the scenes API has been updated it's just a matter of the app showing it to me but it's not showing it to me and I, I really don't think that message was tire pressure related but I really would have liked to have known for sure and I can't change the scroll wheel to go look at it um, in the car right now so I have no clue what the tire pressure is. I do think uh all the rain has passed us, so if Don's able to go for his walk, we can we can go. Wow, look at the pretty leaves coming out. Hey buddy, how are you? Do you stay dry up there during a little bit more rain? Hi. Hello. You sleepy? Well, Don says it didn't rain heavy here like it rained in Raleigh, which I guess is good. I don't think we're going to get any more significant rain. I'm not going to say it might not sprinkle uh, or later this afternoon, but I mean here in the next couple hours there's some stuff pretty far off to the west that I don't think is headed our way. So it may not get all sunny and happy out, but at least <laughs> it's not pouring on us. We've seen squirrels and we've seen bunnies this morning. Good morning, bunny. Hi. How are you? He's just eating away. Got grass in his mouth, not really paying me too much attention. Well, it Hi. does look like we're having another little cell come up from Sanford, so it's yeah. a good thing we got our walk, walk in. in. Yeah, yeah. Got sprinkles on the windshield. Yeah, so I'm going to pull Ruby in just on the off chance I'm asleep at the switch and there's hail in the cell or something. Yeah, something I'm a, weird. Yeah. yeah, that one day that I got her in the garage within five minutes of the hail that dented the garage door yeah, and, and busted that. some of the siding on the house. Yeah. I need to really make, I don't leave her out anymore if there's a ch even a yeah, chance. I totally support that. Thank and you she, for th thinking of Ruby. Yeah, thanks for walking with me so I won't feel quite so guilty when I have that piece of brownie cheesecake that I bought at Whole Foods with our guests tonight. <laughs> right, we can, we said, well, we, uh, we're, we exercise. We walked our three miles. Yeah, that's right. Yep. We've been having uh, pretty heavy rain on and off. I thought I'd uh, come out and see Panther and Gray for a few minutes and show you the pretty dogwood blossoms that are uh, out in our front yard right now. I've been seeing the bluebirds on this tree right here in front of the dogwood um, a lot and I do think we have a nest in our box. But I haven't peeked. Hey Panther. Yeah, you can see where they trimmed around his boo-boo there maybe, but it does not look swollen or oozing or infected, it's just a uh, healing we'll call it healing not pretty but healing gray's over there being shy hey bud 
Um, I was going to add that, um, I was going to add something. You going to trust to come see me now, too? Good. Come up in your chair. Come on. Come up in your chair. Hi, Miss Hard to Get. Playing hard to get. You going to come up? You'll be happier. There you go. Good girl. You don't have to be so hard to get. That's a good girl. Good girl. Yeah, I know what I was going to say now. I did request my birth certificate from New Jersey. Um, $35 in four to six weeks. Oh, well. I have no idea if the uh, rain is over for the day or not. I think not. Our friends got soaked over on NC State campus. That's a real bummer. Um, even though they don't live here now, they used to live here, so they're very familiar with North Carolina weather and all that good stuff. But still, that's just a bummer. It rained for their walking tour. <laughs> One of the worst rains we've had in the wild, to be clear. I'm headed downtown to get Johnny. I'm mostly on time. Hopefully it won't be raining at pickup time. Um, and then he won't care so much. I'm, I'm five minutes later than I wanted to be. I was doing some extra cleaning and I hustled as best I could. I One of the things I did was the fish tank in his uh, computer green room. So anyway, I stayed busy. I'm always busy. I'm never not busy. Sometimes I do just want to sit there, but not really. That's a big yawn. <laughs> hey, buddy. Our friends ought to be pulling up any minute. I got ribs in the oven. Our broccoli, cheese, egg, casserole in the toaster oven. And uh, I think we're ready. Hey, bud.